Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Minecraft. So in the last episode we put our wall all the way around at least too high, trying to protect ourselves. We went down, cleared out the tunnel and got rid of a lot of those zombie noises which were frustrating the heck out of me. So I'm glad we were able to do so. Um, in this video what we will do is firstly eat some of this and we will be working out on the land. So I'll clear out everything we have on the inside. Uh, we'll plug up all the holes. We'll leave the lights down there because, let's face it, we do not want those noises coming back. So I'm going to make everything the same level as the house and then we'll use that mud to block up all the holes. We have a nice canvas to work on, which is nice and flat. We can start separating it all out into different farm areas. And of course the spade breaks straight away. Brilliant. Okay. Okay. Let's have a couple of spades. A one and a two and a one, two. We also need to get the loom bench doing. Um doing sounds like <laughs> I don't know. Something wrong with me. Okay, so yeah, we'll get the loom bench down and then um, we'll see what that does. But we'd have to go chop up some more trees for that one because it takes a couple of planks and we've got one left. Trees are going to be an issue, but we will um, separate an area in here somewhere for trees. We will grow them and harvest them here. Not many because it's not a huge area, but. It'll be something. And something is certainly better than nothing. I won't do it too close to the wall. Eventually I'd like to have a, a nice big wall. I think I said in the last one. Um, a nice big wall in which I can walk around, potentially shoot enemies and harvest them. We're going to be dealing with endermen. So I'll make it so that they can't teleport up there and do me in. Um, and uh, yeah, it'll be nice, nice to look at. There we go. Look. This hole will be covered up. And once I've figured out the farms, if I do need to add an extra layer to the floors, then I will do. Um, I'll go underneath and sort that out so we can have water running between crops. But it really depends on where we put stuff because I want to have a lot more crops growing than I do currently. I want to have a lot more animals. And I'm going to want to put some sand in here to have the cactus and the sugar canes grow in here too so we can have a nice big supply of everything. Because I know making books costs a lot of sugar cane to make paper and blah blah blah. Um, so yeah, we'll, uh, we'll start work on that as soon as we can. I would sleep through tonight, but this is going to be a nice test to see if the walls are any good. I know we've got dark areas inside the walls, but eventually we won't. I will sort all that out as we go. I don't want nothing spawning in here, especially creepers. I'll try not to have too many overhanging roof bits either so they're safe places for them to stand out of the sun. There we go. Don't worry about the walls at the moment. I know that uh, you're going to see the mud in places. Oh, I don't want another one. That's not important. We will sort it all out. Oh, here we go. Look, my wall is not functional at all. They are spawning in the dark places. That's all right. Oh, there's a bunch. Okay. How many of you? How many? Two. Right, you spawned around here. Let's pop a few torches down. There we go. Let's cover up these holes. is unbelievable. Okay, so you can hold the mouse button down. 
just start spamming it. But that's how you make more mistakes, I guess. Well, you make mistakes anyway, especially when this tool bus is considered. It's all robust on the other stuff. I will tolerate it is in with the animals, but we don't know where we're putting them yet, so I ain't leaving it. Cool. There's always something quite relaxed about the Minecraft music. Hopefully, my sound is working alright. Um, I, I, I am still having an issue with it, but. Hopefully you can hear the music alright, but not too loud. Hopefully you can hear me. But once I do the editing, I will check it out. Um, but there's only so much I seem to be able to edit of it. So I haven't, I've probably not got it set up right. And my friend that does YouTube, he, he's offered to come and sort it out for me, but I've got to wait for all this COVID nonsense to get out of the way. We can't, we can't be broken rules. Do it when it's safe to do so. Until then, you've got me and my technical support. Yeah. Okay, right. Let's make another two. I've got sticks, wonderful. I have enough sticks. Should make an iron one? Would that be better? Probably. Uh, hmm. Do I need a torch in here? Don't know. I'll tell you what. I'll just fill this in. Fill this up. So nothing can spawn in here. I'll try and make it so there's at least no too high standing area. So a zombie can't then just spawn in, I assume. Because it's bigger than two. Uh, bigger than one, sorry. Um, yeah, so that's my reasoning behind the leaving little gaps. And so there's no big gaps. Yes. Oh, we went round it. That's a miracle. Corner chunk. That was a creeper inside. No, the walls are not working. <laughs> it will, it will. We just gotta get it lit up, don't worry. Leave the panic in to me. Zombie and spider over there in the chat. You are still over there. You stay there. I'll deal with you in you know. no. Goodness, I might have to make a metal one, you know. Iron shovel. This is taking ages. I used to always use stone tools because I thought I don't want to waste my iron. But the rate we're going, we've got plenty of iron and it only takes one to make a shovel. So when we go back to building up one, I think we'll do that. I like using diamond tools because their durability works. It's pretty good. Um, so you ain't got to worry too much about replacing it every minute. I never use golden tools because um, golden tools are rubbish. I mean, they, they do the job, don't get me wrong, but their durability is really, really poor. I assume they're still the same. Um, so gold is only really useful for making the odd thing that you need like golden nuggets 
or golden powered track for your minecarts, which we will definitely be having minecarts in here. From one area to another. I mean, we'll eventually get one down into the mine. That'd be nice. I want to find a village. We'll have one going to the village. We'll make sure the village is safe with plenty of babies. So we have a good area to trade. I want to get look, where'd that creeper go? Oh. Should have dealt with it. That's gonna surprise me. Be in my house or something. Oh the door's open as well, so <laughs> it actually actually might be. No. I need to go get some ocelots, I think. Is it ocelot? Ocelot? Cat? I can call it a cat. Oh, wait, wait. Alright. Are you in my house, punk? Where did it go? Does it despawn? Maybe. Alright, let's take out the iron. Put that iron in there. I need some sticks. Oh. Oh. Let's go get some sticks to climb the wall. That's right. Haha, -ha, you died. You died. Did you have like a golden helmet? No. Okay. Daybar trees. Lovely. What on earth is going on? They're attacking me. Why? What did? How did you get in there? Holy moly! What are they? They got crossbows out. I mean. I don't think they're friendly. Oh no. <laughs> what? So now Minecraft has base raids, does it? Is that what's about to happen to me? I gotta kill them. He's a little trader man, he was nice. But they, he didn't have a weapon out. I see a crossbow. And they got they got a flag and there's a whole bunch of them. Oh man. <laughs> the most unlucky Minecraft playthrough there has ever been. What was that noise? Seriously, man. I don't know. I don't know what's going on with this game. It's become creepy. There's a spider on the ground or something. Oh. We'll just pretend this hole never existed. Get rid of that. There we go. Keep that water source. Why not? Okay, can I get back in to my house? Where'd they go? Oh, they're still there. Oh, they're all looking at me. Don't mind me, guys. <laughs> I'm sure you have come in peace. Are you villagers? Why are you pointing them at me now? Holy! Oh, you reloading? Oh, hey! Ah! <laughs> what am I supposed to do? No, oh, that's it. Come on, then. Get off my land. 
Ow, ow, ow. Yeah, die. Ha! Killed your friend. Shoot your own guy. Kill the leader. No. Guys, what is happening? No. I'm glad it hurts. My super rapid punches. I need my sword. Made voluntary exile. What is that in the top right there? Alrighty. I've that's what their face looked like. Does this mean that they're all gonna start coming for me now? Mm -hmm. What have I done? They, they they gave me no choice, they shot me. Look. I'm full of arrows. What's this? I got their flag. Ooh. Take a bunch of sticks. We need some of that for the loom. Can we build the loom? I think that was uh, two and two, wasn't it? Yeah, look at that. I'll go pop that down. We'll build some of that. This can be all sticks because mm -hmm. we need. We need sticks. I got no spade. We we're going to make a spade. I dropped my saplings. Oh. All right. So we need food. This. What can we do with this flag? Was that Matt? Can I put it higher? Oh, I, oh so either go on the floor. Oh, just change. All right. Tell your friends about me. Yeah. See, you come here again. I'll take your flag and put it on my walls. Where's my fish? I need to eat. I'm going to have to come and kill some more of you lot. That's, um, oh no, I've got some food, that's fine. Let's put my loom down. What's this do? Colour? No idea. Put anything in there then. String? No, you don't take string. Nope, no idea. But we got one, so that's cool. Let's upgrade our tool situation, shall we? We've got plenty of them, so we'll use them. Quality of life, lovely. Right, I'm gonna feed you all up. Don't come running out of here. I want, I'm gonna want some feathers off you guys soon, all right? So I mean, I'm gonna have to start killing you. I want some arrows. No, don't run out of there. Guys, I'm making a break for it. I'm gonna kill you. I said I wanted feathers. You escapees, my victims. Okay, now let's feed the cows. See what happened to the escapee chickens, guys? Did ya? Did ya? You guys grew up pretty quick, so there's no babies in it at the moment. Let's go through. Good. Everyone got some. We'll get more baby. Okay, let's see what this iron one does. Oh yeah, that's better. Do -do 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 -do. That's a 
character ability. Like, gonna be alright. I imagine it'd be better than that one. Or is it just the speed increase? I'm not sure. So we defended a raid, I guess. I don't know how often they're gonna come. I don't know if I upgrade the survivability of this game. I don't know if I need to uh, prepare for the attack of them now. That's pretty cool. Certainly more interesting. Let's get this area flat. Might go do a bit of exploring. I mean, we definitely want to find out where our nearest village is. But we do want to get this base sort of done as quick as we can. I need to make an handle or something. Maybe I'll go do that in a minute. But do I wait for the base to be a bit bigger? Because we ain't really got enough room. I don't know. I want to gather a bunch more stone. So maybe we'll make the mine first before we do the house. So we'll just pop the mine over in one of the corners. Dig down. Get a bunch of stone while we grow some wood up in the ground. What do you reckon? Did I not make? No. Look at that, that's nearly broke already. If there's any other use for them, I'm sure they're one of the dye recipes. Nearly there, we nearly have a flat area. Lovely. Get rid of all this grass. Hopefully, the grass grows back on the rest of it. I'll get a load more torches, we'll start plonking them down in all these darker areas. That'll be good. Hopefully this has got enough durability just to get us through this corner. Nope. So much stuff. Keep the sticks. Um, we need some of this.
light this area right up. We don't want no more raids. We don't want no more zombies, creepers spawning in here at the moment. Or ever, potentially. Look really dark here, I'll put that on there. Any sort of real dark areas? Oh, I didn't ever put any in here. Oh man. Okay. We will sort all this out. It's not to worry. Get this done. Area, do you think the mine should go in? I'm thinking maybe this corner would be quite nice for the mine. Um, I don't have a clue where the map is. I don't have a map, so I can't see where there's a big land mass which way. Um, but we will sort that out. There we go. Ah, that's better. Let's take this one. Go stick that down here. There we go. Hopefully that stopped things spawning in for a bit. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. has a mountain. We want to be making a door as well to come outside. That way, I know there's water that way. Should we head towards the mountain ranges? Yeah. Oh seriously, he's got a finish point. <laughs> Go away. Okay. is where the mine will be. I'll go get some torches and we'll sort that out. Let's go. Let's go mining. Start it off at least. I will make this mine oh, a bit bigger. I want to have some stairs going up and down. Is that right? Yeah, I want that one as well. Just drop down 
H1, do four, drop down to four. Until we get to the bottom. Oh. Put them up there out of the way. There we go. We'll do some real nice strip mining. Um, once we get down there, make a little area to build tools, have everything we need. We'll just make a massive area. Good. I quite enjoy the mining, it's quite quite relaxing. Okay. This is where it gets expensive. Um, the durability on these are not fantastic so as you can see we are going through tools quite quick already um i'll block up with that i'm not going to use that and it's kind of like well when i'm mining stone do i really need an iron pickaxe well, i don't know but we'll use one for now and we'll see how we get on future we may we may slow it down just to conserve some stuff we don't want to use everything I hear water so we may well run into a little mine in a minute I hope not I want to reach the bottom nice and smart no problems straight down to the bottom so I can plan I don't mind if we hit water or mines while we're, when we're down there we need to, a base of operations there first see I'm covering up every hole as we go well we've been here okay let's ignore it we'll keep going and I'll plug that hole up Using the art on white bricks. Oh, I know. Take that though. Righty, righty, righty. Keep it going. Do I get some new recipe for the flint? I should imagine. I know these are not the most exciting videos ever. There's little to talk about and there's certainly little to do other than mine and get resources. So I do apologize.
if uh, you guys are interested in games like this which i assume if you're watching it you are um go check out my alex alec the lock king i can't even speak today alec the lost kingdom game let's play um it's pretty good it's really calming i mean minecraft definitely has its relaxing moments don't get me wrong but that is just you can get people to do jobs for you which is wonderful and um yeah there's it's still early access um so they hopefully they added a lot more in but if you can get to sort of like the depths of minecraft you imagine how much is in this game one day they could put it in a game like that and it'll just be superb graphics are good for you know they're not realistic but they're good I can hear lava I assume it's lava all right so we've got to be more careful all this redstone means we are getting down to the rough levels that we want to be soon anyway so redstone usually is spawning around lava as far as I'm aware don't know what that noise was. <laughs> Who knows? Let's munch. See, I like I like beef. Fills you up. Fills you up good. Oh crikey! Throw my phone. It's beeping away at me. People. Maybe we can keep this up. Lovely. Did I make um I want a spare crafting table for when I when I get down there? Definitely a good idea. There's so much less annoying annoying when you don't have zombies all the time going Ooh. Still got that thing in the top right corner for upset them people that came to me and started shooting at me. Angry little villagers. Gold. Mm. Ah, bedrock. That's a good sign. Oh, I'm happy about that. So we want to stay on the top layer of bedrock and I'll tell you what I'm just going to build from here and we'll, we'll use layers okay so we've got lava we need to find out where this lava is when lava's above you like a layer or so I think it's one layer it'll drip through the, the rock or anything that's above you so um, you'll know same with water uh, it just drips through the ceiling so you'll know if you're underneath it which 
can be handy. Little tip. Oh no, we are one level too low, which I should know. Okay, we'll stay on this level. I just don't like having bits sticking up, so that's going to be my floor where I can't go any deeper. There we go, we'll go nice four high. Make a nice big cut out. Down here we will melt metals, make tools and equipment just to strip mine. You see how that is now dripping through? Did you see that? Yeah, there it is. See? There's lava up there. But luckily, we're not going any higher than that at the moment. We'll let it drip through. We still may come across it as we go. There might be a little low point for it. That's okay. There we go. While we're here, let's uh, build a few of these. Happy days. Now yeah, we're ready to rock and roll. We have a mine. I'll be strip mining in here. I will extend it this way. I will extend it this way, and we will strip mine all the way across, leaving two gaps. So, say right here, I dig this out. What I want to do is leave one, leave two, and dig here. Because then each side, I'm. Oh, here we go. Look. I'm going down each side so I can see what's on this one. I can see what's on that one from here. So that is the best way of doing that. We can proper strip mine this all out. Any lava we come across will plug. If we can't pass it over it or around it, we will block the hole so we cannot go down there anymore. So we know, right, let's not go that way. When I say block the hole, I mean like block it off either down the hole or block the actual hole. Okay, so what I'll do is, yeah, I'll continue digging it all out like this way and the other way so that we have more than just three strips. I want to have at least five on the go at any one time. Um, but we will be working on one hole till we get to about, I don't know, 50. 50 blocks in and then we'll do all of them to 50 blocks and then we'll take them all to 100 blocks or so. I don't really count it but I'll just go by torches about 5 block, like 5 torches so when it gets dark which is in about 5 or 6 torches place another one, count it alright so I'm going to call that an episode and thank you all for watching next episode we shall increase the strip mine and we'll then head back up to work on our farm as we have a bit of cobblestone building now so that'll be handy and hopefully we'll have enough materials to do what we need to do so thanks for watching please take care the dude is out